Hi, it's Apple1975, and welcome to Elite Dangerous on Legacy version. And today I thought I'd take a look at the power play situation. So we've been divorced from Legacy for one cycle. So let's have a look at how power play is shaping up on Legacy at the moment. Uh, in the background, you've got some clips. <laughs> Meta somehow arrived on my deck of my carrier, not in my carrier. But let's have a look. So Edmund Mann is in first place, and we have four powers in turmoil already. Uh, Yep, Space Trump's in turmoil, Felicia Witness is in turmoil, so the feds are screwed, Leon Rue's in turmoil, and one of the imps is in turmoil, a living Guy Deval. All in turmoil in the first week. Um, I think that might be because of the lack of engagement from player base and uh, people being trolls. But, um, yeah, four, four characters in turmoil already is uh, a look at things to come. Now, I noticed uh, through the course of the week that not much got done on the power play front. I came down to hand in um, my uh, you know, my power play tokens, and uh, I didn't see a lot of movement on the power play leaderboards on Xbox. Now, the legacy version includes the PlayStation, Xbox, and uh, PC players on older PCs. And since we divorced from the main game, the legacy version has got its own power play and BGS. Yeah, somehow Meta traveled to my to this system on the deck of my carrier. Um, so he wasn't actually below, he was above, but that's what I saw on my screen. Very weird. Uh, Meta was very like, what the hell is going on? Uh, on the comms about it. It was quite funny. Uh, yeah, A Living E Duval's in um, turmoil, but also has four expansions. Four expansions, which is insane. Uh, how that happened. Um, and across the board, it's all a bit, like, weird. Um, I don't know what's going on. Uh, it's, it's either a lack of players, or some groups have players, other groups don't. And uh, some groups are taking real advantage of that. I know it's big ups for um, Pravnal Antal and Yuri Grom, but I don't know if that's player-driven or if that's the fact that others are falling behind. Um, you know, Hudson seems to be one of the hardest hits, but that's not a surprise. Uh, his power play has always been very freakish. Um, you know, there's a lot of expansions for a lot of powers this week, but will you see anyone at these expansions? We don't know. I think Denton de Petraeus got the biggest boost uh, coming into this. He also he went out in places and he's got uh, six expansions on the go. Uh, Winters ha is in turmoil but has one expansion to look at. But Archon Delane has moved up to 9th and has an expansion. Yes, an expansion for Archon Delane. Leon Rue, the newbie's favourite, got himself stuck into turmoil and Granny is doing nothing at the bottom, propping up the pack. Uh, I don't know if this is going to turn into a dumpster fire or whether people are going to take opportunity of this and like do something with the power play on the legacy version. Uh, or if it's going to go to let rack and ruin and be left to be a dumpster fire. I honestly don't know at this point. It's interesting how much has happened in the space of one week though. Anyway, that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And will you be taking part in power play?